integer is not the only type that holds number in csr programming language there are so many other built-in types in csr to work with the numbers these are bytes sort integers and longs all of these types also have multiple variants let's understand about all of them and the difference in between them here is a list of all the predefined integral types in csr programming language first is s byte we call them sign 8 bit integer then we have byte it is unsigned 8 bit integer then we have sort it is called as sign 16 bit integer then we have u sort it is called as unsigned 16 bit integer so basically the first two is 8 bit then we have 16 bit then we have 32 bit then we have 64 bit and these two at the last n int that is sign integer and the second one that is n u int which is called as unsigned integer these are something new that has been added in c sharp 9 version we will talk about these two in next video but here in this video we will talk about these above eight types if you want to define any kind of variable in c sharp programming language then the process is quite similar let's say i want to define one type for s byte first you have to provide the name of your type which is called as alias let's provide a meaningful name let's say where one And that's it we can also use system dot s byte over here like this so the process is quite similar for all the types but what is the difference the difference is in between their size so what i'm doing over here is i'm going to write some console dot write line statements and here i will write size of s byte and this is going to be we can find out the size of any type by using the size of operator and inside the size of operator we have to provide a type it is going to be s byte now let's write the max value and similarly the min value let's run this application and let's see what is the output here you will see what is the size of this s byte the size is one byte then what is the maximum value that it can hold it can hold only 127 as the maximum value and what about the minimum value the minimum value is minus 128 do you remember that circular side from the last video where we were talking about the size of the integer type the same concept also goes over here if you will add 1 to this maximum size then you will get minus 128 in the output the only difference in between all these integral type is this size so first let's display the size of all of them so here i'm going to copy all these lines and basically over here i want to have one blank line as well what i'm doing over here is here i'm inserting one new empty line there is one more way i can also use this symbol over here the symbol will add a new line let's just cut it and let's run this application again you will see after three lines we are having one line space this is coming just because of this symbol okay let's just paste it here as well because i do not want to write the blank console or write any statement and here quickly i will type all the other types here i have written the complete code for all these eight types what i'm doing over here is first i'm writing the size of that actual type then what is the maximum value that it can hold and what is the minimum value that it can hold otherwise all other concepts like making it nullable how to find out how to declare it how to assign it all of them are completely similar let's run this application and let's see what is the output here you will see on the output window we are having some very strange size if we talk about this s byte which is the signed 8 bit integer so the size that it will take in memory is 1 byte what is the maximum value that it can hold it is 127 what is the minimum value it is minus 128 if we talk about this unsigned type then the size is same because the type is byte so for both of them the size is going to be one byte but the difference in between these two is in the maximum and minimum value the maximum value in case of signed 8 bit integer is 127 but here it is 255 why because the unsigned types cannot hold the negative values so they will start from zero and if you will move these negative values to this positive side then you will get this 
255 so basically if you are having a situation where you need to deal with very small value for example you are having a class and in your class you are having you know that there will be only maximum 200 or 225 students then you can definitely go with this byte if you think that you need to play with some very small values and there can be negative values as well then you have to go with this s byte which is sign integer 8 bit talking about the sort the size of the sort type in memory is 2 byte but what is the maximum value and minimum value the maximum value of sort is this 32767 this one also have a negative value similarly if you talk about the unsigned type then the minimum value is 0 and the maximum value is this 65535 the ultimate learning over here is that you need to find out what is the correct type for your program if you think that the number can exceed more than 127 or more than 255 then you have to go with this sort but if you are very sure that the value will be less than this integer value then definitely you can go with this sort so again depends everything on your situation this one will hold only one byte this one will take two bytes this one will take four bytes and this long will take eight bytes this is the maximum value that we can have in c sharp programming language and it is in unsigned long the first two types are called as 8-bit integer these are called as 16-bit integer this is called as 32-bit integer and this is called as 64-bit integer and this is the complete code that we have written in our program so here i'm not making any further change in this code what you have to do is you have to declare all of them you have to assign the values of all these types and you have to display the values on the console screen make sure to practice all of them make all of them as nullable also just try to perform some operations like sum minus multiply etc and try to display the values on the console screen that is all in this video thank you for watching have a great day